adding music in KineMaster can be a challenge for beginners. In this video, I am going to show you how to add music in KineMaster using a simple method. Just make sure to watch this video until the very end, because after watching this video, you will know how to add music to your projects easily. So I am going to show you this process using an Android device, but the process should be similar on an iOS device too, so without any further ado, let's get started right away. So I have my KineMaster app open over here and now I am simply going to start a new project by tapping on this button. And then let's tap on create. And I am just going to pick something random for the example and then tap on this X icon at the top right hand side of the screen. So this is the clip that I just selected. I am just going to scroll to the beginning of the video. So, if I want to add music to this video, I just need to tap on this audio option over here on the circle, and then you can get music from the KineMaster store. You can listen to any of these, and if you find something that you like, you can simply press download to get that music. So now, if I go back, you can see that this is the track that I downloaded and now I can select that and tap on this plus button and then tap on this X icon at the top right hand side of the screen, and that's one way to add music to your project on KineMaster. But what about if you want to add your own music to your project? So let's delete the track that I just added and then let's tap on the audio option again, and let's tap the songs option over here. And it's going to show you all the songs that you have on your phone. If you don't have any songs on your phone right now, you can simply download some copyright-free music from YouTube. So, if you have songs on your phone, you can select any of them and then tap on this plus icon, followed by this X icon, at the top right hand side of the screen. And that's how you can simply add music on KineMaster. So you can also do other stuff to the music that you choose. For example, you can trim it. You can loop the music. You can bass boost it, and so much more. If you found this video helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and do consider subscribing to my channel for more step-by-step -step tutorials like this one. And if you have any questions about all of this, please let me know in the comments section below. Thanks so much for watching. Have a good day.